Hello everyone, it is Scriptus here today with your first ever Java tutorial. So um, we're gonna get started pretty much straight off the bat. So what's step one when programming? Well, we need an IDE. We need something to program in. An IDE is a uh, integrated development environment. It basically will compile all the code we write and make it so that we can. Oh, damn, voice cracks. Uh, make it so that we can uh, work well with Java and it adds a whole bunch of features that we can use to make us more efficient when programming. So <clears throat> how do we get to uh, an IDE? Well first you open the web browser of your choice, mine's Google Chrome, and then you simply type in um, w.eclipse.org forward slash downloads forward slash. <clears throat> if you can't be bothered to type that in, there will be a link in the description below. You then will download Eclipse IDE for Java developers, if, uh, and then to download the version. So if you're 32 bit or 64 bit, download the corresponding version. Okay, so now that you have installed Eclipse, let's get started. So open Eclipse. Your version might be different. I'm using Luna, which is the latest at the time of recording. But if you're watching after time recording, obviously it might be a different version. But the core features of the clip should be the same. So you'll probably see a layout like this, I would assume. Maybe not though, it will, it depends. So the first step is to go to File, New, Java Project. You don't want to choose uh, Project. Oops. Whoa. Yeah, a lot of people choose Project and then they're like, oh my god, my Java Project doesn't work. Like, yeah, that's because you chose project, not Java project. Make sure it's a Java project so that Eclipse opens it correctly. Java project. And we just call it, or I'm gonna call it, um, YT1, but you tutorial one, you can call it whatever pretty much. There's no real naming conventions for uh, projects overall. And now you open it and you'll see SRC and Java system library. This is just like things that we can import to use as Java is module based. But we just for now right click on SRC and new class. We'll ignore packages for now. And just call this class class one. It's proper convention to call classes with a capital. So you should do that. And inside um, your class, you need to uh, write this so public static void main string args. Right? And then to test it, write system.out.print line and then just type whatever you want. And now I'm just going to do the classic hello world. And this should be enough to run the program, so just press run. And as you can see in the console, it has output a hello world. So next time we get on to uh, creating and analyzing this program and knowing what each thing line of code does, thank you very much for watching the first episode and first ever Java tutorial of this series. Like, favorite, and subscribe. Subscribe. Goodbye.